The Hughes H-4 Hercules stands as one of the most extraordinary aircraft in aviation history, a testament to engineering ambition and wartime innovation. Conceived during the critical years of World War II, this massive flying boat emerged from an urgent military necessity to transport personnel and material across the perilous Atlantic Ocean, where German U-boats were wreaking havoc on Allied shipping. The brainchild of industrialist Henry John Kaiser and aircraft designer Howard Hughes, the H-4 was born from a 1942 United States War Department contract requiring an aircraft capable of crossing the Atlantic with substantial payload. Due to wartime material restrictions, the aircraft was constructed primarily from wood using the innovative Duramold process, a laminated plywood and resin composite technique that was considered a technological marvel of its time. Nicknamed the Spruce Goose, a moniker Hughes personally despised, the aircraft was actually built almost entirely of birch. Its specifications were nothing short of remarkable. Designed to carry 150,000 pounds, 750 fully equipped troops, or two 30-ton Sherman tanks. With a wingspan longer than a football field and standing over five stories tall, the Hercules eclipsed any transport aircraft of its era. Development was painfully slow. Initial plans called for three aircraft to be constructed within two years, but progress was hampered by material restrictions, Hughes' perfectionism, and Kaiser's eventual withdrawal from the project. The total development cost reached $23 million, equivalent to $246 million in 2023. The aircraft's sole flight occurred on November 2, 1947, with Hughes himself at the controls. During a taxi test near Cabrillo Beach, California, the H-4 lifted off, remaining airborne for 26 seconds at 70 feet altitude, traveling approximately one mile at 135 miles per hour. This brief moment proved the aircraft's flight capability, though it would never fly again. After years of meticulous maintenance by a dedicated crew, the Hercules found its permanent home at the Evergreen Aviation and Space Museum in McMinnville, Oregon, arriving on February 27, 1993, after a 138-day, 1,055-mile journey from Long Beach. In 2024, it was listed on the National Register of Historic Places, cementing its legacy as a remarkable piece of technological and aviation history. The Hughes H-4 Hercules remains a symbol of wartime ingenuity, technological ambition, and one man's extraordinary vision, a flying machine that captured the imagination of an entire generation.